What's the matter with you, Henry? Didn't you hear me calling you? Sorry, Father. I was taking a stroll and lost track of time. Somehow I had a feeling I was seeing everything for the first time. How, my boy? When are you going to get some sense? Anyway, we've a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money, then. Yeah, that's the other thing. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh? Not drunkard? <laughs> That'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. Sure I'll be happy to hear it. Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sasau. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now, work won't wait. be with you, Henry. Unfortunately, that's not my problem. Perhaps Sir Radzik is keeping it at the castle until this whole unhappy story reaches its end. I only hope Sigismund doesn't get an appetite for our silver, too. That makes two of us. Come on up and take a leave! I've got everything you need! With pleasure, good man. Good health to you. God be with you.
God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. I knew you'd be trouble. Father says if you don't pay up, he'll come here himself and hammer those nails into your hairy ass. I'd like to see him try. Fuck off, you bastard, or your old man will be pulling those nails out of you. Look, I know things aren't easy. Your wife ran off, booze is dear these days, and you're as much use as a square wheel. It's no wonder you're short of coin. But a debt's a debt, and I can't leave here without something. If I had anything to give, I'd give it. But I've got nothing, so leave me in peace, all of you. And don't come back. You've no business here. Clear off. Lock chest. I'll need a lockpick to get into that. Fritz might have one. What the hell was that? What are you up to here? Get out of here or I'll call the guards on you.
で。Are you quite? Ah. Hey, Henry's come to see us. Good luck then. Hey, Pip, do you want to learn something? No. You can't be serious, Deutsch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. I had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lose. All right, I'll do it. But then you have to give me a hand with something. What do you need? Kuna shows money to father and doesn't want to pay. I tried talking to him, but he wouldn't listen. I need more than words to get coin out of him, and I can't handle it on my own. No problem. We'll back you up. Just as soon as we're done plastering Deutsch's house. I'll be happy to sort out that drunken elf. All right. Let's go while Deutsch is still sitting safely in the tavern. or not. Wait. We have to check that the coast is clear. Why? Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go and lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. Welcome, Henry. What do you want, lad? I just went by the tavern and your husband was in there talking nonsense. 
I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh, well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right and King Wenceslas is a drunkard, that sort of thing. Some people took exception, so I thought... God almighty, the fool. Next thing he'll start on about the Popes. He might have mentioned the Popes too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! For king and country! For king and country, my ass! This is all good, clean, fun! <laughs> Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund! Woohoo! Eat shit, Dodgers! You bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> hey, hands! Can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Poor sons! Let's make those smites off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this poxy Deutscher? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. <laughs> Fuck her! I'll make you pay for that! What do you think you're playing at? Are you trying to get yourselves in trouble? The Deutsch was insulting King Wenceslas. He got what he deserved. So that's why. Deutsch isn't a bad fellow, but he should drop this nonsense about Sigismund before someone torches his house. So you don't mind that we... Don't gape like a stuffed squirrel. Do you take me for a German lover? I serve my lord and... So I won't go to jail? Ha! Who paid for your grub? You know what? The do... Hey! Red buttons, laces! Come, people, come!
Well, we sorted that Deutsch out. <laughs> that was pretty close, eh? Actually, he caught me. What? Then how come you're here? He let me go. He's on our side. What? Are you pulling my pizzle? He doesn't like the Deutsch any more than we do. He said he'll fix it somehow. Great. Looks like your dawdling paid off. Anyway, nice job at the Deutsches. Never a dull moment with you lot. <laughs> Listen, there's this locked chest I need to get into. Really? An honest tray not good enough for you anymore? It's just that someone has something that doesn't belong to him, and I want to take it back. <laughs> if you say so. Can't it's not skin off my nose anyway. <laughs> Never heard of you. Thanks, Fritz. Who's there? Oh. I need a hand with... Sure, mate. You are... Let's get to it, then. Kunesh, get out here, you old goat. I've something to show you. What the fuck are you here for? You want me to take a whip to you or call a catch pole? Just try it, you old drunk. You had it coming, you pup. 
And your old man can fuck off too. A locked chest. I'll need a lockpick to get into that. Fritz might have one. Welcome, Henry. Let's have a word about the price. Sure, why not? Well, that's a decent price. Can we do something about the price? Aye. I knew we'd come to an arrangement. God be with you, Henry. 